children let us continue the chapter quadrilaterals that is understanding quadrilaterals now let us solve the exercise second the first question is find x in the following figure here x is an ex exterior angle and also other two exterior angles are given it is a polygon with three sides it is a triangle and it is shown that the two angles are 125 degree 125 degree and the third exterior angle is x we have to find the value of x and we know that sum of exterior angle of a polygon is equals to 360 degree here there are three exterior angles as it is a triangle now two exterior angles are given and find the sum of the given two exterior angle and subtract the sum from the 360 degree then you will get the value of x here so you take in figure in the figure you write x degree plus 125 degree plus 125 degree is equals to 360 degree because you know that sum of exterior angle of a polygon is equals to 360 degree the triangle is also a polygon now that x degree plus 125 plus 125 is 250 degree that is equals to 360 degree therefore x degree is equals to 360 degree minus 250 degree that is equals to 110 degree so you got the value of x is 110 degree here next you take the second question here two angles are given and also three angle this is given that this is 90 degree and here this is 90 means this must be 90 because the sum must be 180 degree now here x is here and the remaining two angles 70 degree and 60 degree are given so you take the it is the figure b in the figure in the figure you take 90 degree plus 60 degree plus 90 degree plus 70 degree plus x is equals to it is 360 degree sum of exterior angle of a polygon is equals to 360 degree then they for sum of this four 90 plus 60 is 150 150 plus 90 is 240 240 plus 70 is 310 it is plus x is equals to 360 degree so here x is equals to 360 degree minus 310 degree that is equals to 50 degree second question find measure of each exterior angle of a regular polygon of nine sides 15 sides you know that this formula to find the exterior angle of regular polygon is equals to 360 by n here so you take the first one here here n is equals to 9 number of sides is equals to 9 and each exterior angle each exterior angle angle of regular polygon regular polygon equals what 360 degree by n 360 degree by n so it is 360 degree n is 9 that is equals to 9 ones are 9 fours are that is 40 is a 40 degree so the measure of each exterior angle of a regular polygon of nine sides is 40 degree therefore you write each exterior angle of regular polygon of nine sides is 
40 degree is here 40 degree the next one is exterior angle of regular polygon of 15 sides the second one n equals 15 again here you write each exterior angle of regular polygon of 15 sides 15 or each exterior angle of polygon equals each exterior angle of regular polygon equals you write that formula that is 360 by n here here n equals 15 means that equals 360 degree by 15 then you divide here 15 ones are 15 twos it is and 6 is remain 60 24 it is so you got 24 degree therefore each exterior angle of regular polygon of 15 sides is 24 degree is 24 degree next you take how many sides does a how many sides does a polygon has if the measure of each exterior angle is 24 degree here we have to find out so let us have exterior angle is equals to 24 degree what you have to find out n equals question mark and here it must be a regular polygon here you have the word regular then only you can get the measurement of each exterior angle otherwise the exterior angles are having different values here so you write each exterior angle equals each exterior angle equals exterior angle equals what 360 by n so you write 24 degrees equals to 360 degree by n therefore n is equals to 360 by 24 so you know that 12 2 is a 12 3 is a 36 30 is a 2 1 is a 2 15 is a, it is therefore you will get n is equals to 15 here how many sides does a regular polygon has if the measure of each exterior angle is 24 degree here the polygon the regular polygon has how much sides here 15 sides therefore the polygon has the regular polygon has 15 sides if its each exterior angle is angle is 24 degree 24 degree it is next question how many sides does a regular polygon have if each interior angle is 165 degree again it is a regular polygon now here interior angle is given means you can get the exterior angle so it is interior angle is given that is how much 165 degree each interior angle is 165 degree means each exterior angle that is exterior angle is equals to 180 minus 165 degree that is equals to you know that is 15 degree here the sum of interior angle 
and exterior angle must be equals to 180 degree as they forms the linear pair and the each interior angle is given that is 165 degree then each exterior angle equals 180 degree minus 165 degree that is 15 degree now number of sides you can have here therefore therefore you take each exterior angle of regular polygon equals 360 degree by n here so each exterior angle you got that is 15 degree is equals to 360 degree by n therefore n is equals to 360 degree by 15 you know that 15 ones are 15 twos it is and 6 is remaining that is 4s are so you will get 24 so how many sides does a regular polygon have it is 24 sides therefore the polygon polygon has how much sides 24 sides The fifth question, is it possible to have a regular polygon with measure of each exterior angle as 22 degree? Now again, let us use the same formula and try to get the value of when a positive integer, then you can say that it is a regular polygon. So here what is given? each exterior angle is given that is 22 degree so let us find the number of sides then you write each exterior angle equals equals what exterior angle of regular polygon regular polygon equals that is 360 degree by n it is given that 22 degree is equals to 360 degree by n therefore n is equals to 360 degree by 22 so if you divide 360 by 360 by 22 you know that 22 ones are 22 what is remaining here 6 minus 2 is 4 3 minus 2 is 1 here and here you know that 22 pi is 110 22 6 so you will get 132 you will get 6 is 132 what is remaining 8 is remaining and if you put 0 you will get here point so 16 point that is 16.3 you will get 66 again you get a remainder here that is how much 10 minus 6 is 4 and 7 minus 6 is 1 year so it is not completely divisible that is 16.3 which is not a positive integer therefore you say as as n is not an integer not a positive integer or n is not a integer so what you can say here it is not possible to have a regular polygon with it is n is not a positive integer n is not a positive integer therefore it is not possible to to have a regular polygon with measure of measure of each ex each exterior angle each exterior angle 
which exterior angle how much 22 degree the b of the fifth question is can it be an interior angle of a regular polygon why can it be means is 22 degree here is 22 degree be an interior angle of a regular polygon so let us have interior angle equal interior angle equals 22 degree then exterior angle becomes exterior angle becomes 180 minus 22 degree that is equals to you can have that is 158 degree 180 minus 22 degree is 150 degree here if 22 degree is the interior angle then 158 degree becomes the exterior angle now again you find the number of sides and verify whether you are getting a positive integer or not so you take each exterior angle equals angle equals 360 degree by n so, what is the exterior angle here? 158 degree. It is 158 degree is equals to 360 by n. Therefore, n is equals to 360 by 158. It is 368, 360 by 158. So, try to divide it. 158, 150, 2 it becomes 1 6 the remainder is 10 minus 6 you will get 4 5 minus 1 also 4 you will get and again here you will get point so you will get a fraction here so it is not a positive integer 2 point something you are going to get that is 2 the again it is 3 1 6 like this a 2.2 2, you will get approximately so here n is not a integer that is not a positive integer so write integer therefore what you can say 22 degree cannot be a cannot be an interior angle of regular polygon regular polygon it may be the interior angle of the non-regular polygon but it cannot be an interior angle of regular polygon so you can't have the regular polygon with exterior angle 22 degree and also interior angle 22 degree the next question is sixth question that is a here what is the minimum interior angle possible for a regular polygon y minimum interior angle means minimum sides we have to think here minimum sides of the regular polygon is you know then polygon is the triangle triangle is the polygon having minimum interior angle and minimum sides and here the word regular polygon means that is nothing but a triangle which is an equilateral triangle here n equals 3 and that is an regular means that is an equilateral triangle and in equilateral triangle the interior angle is 60 degree therefore you can say that the minimum interior angle possible for a regular polygon is 60 degree so you can write first answer minimum interior angle angle possible for a regular polygon is 60 degree that is the minimum as it is a regular polygon next why the answer is here we have to answer the why so you take the minimum sir, polygon with polygon with minimum sides 
that is 3 is triangle minimum sides means 3 less than 3 sides is not possible to have the polygon so polygon with minimum sides is 3 is that is triangle and it must be regular means the regular polygon polygon with three sides is an equilateral triangle is a equilateral triangle the regular polygon with three sides is an equilateral triangle and its interior angle is 60 degree its interior angle is 60 degree this is the reason next what is the maximum exterior angle possible for a regular polygon y and minimum 60 means 180 minus 60 is the 120 that becomes the maximum for the exterior angle take minimum interior means maximum exterior minimum interior angle is so you write the answer here first answer is the maximum exterior angle possible for your polygon maximum exterior angle possible for reg for a regular polygon regular polygon is how much that is 120 degree why it is know that we know that minimum interior angle for the regular polygon is 60 so you know that interior angle plus exterior angle equals to 180 degree interior angle plus exterior angle equals how much 180 degree interior angle interior angle is here how much that is 60 degree means 60 degree plus exterior angle equals 180 degree therefore exterior angle equals equals 180 degree minus 60 degree that is equals to 120 degree so minimum interior angle is 60 degree and maximum exterior angle is 120 degree 